couple of signs after getting an upgrade. Generations of children have climbed on that whale sculpture outside the museum entrance. Earlier this morning, it was packed up and carefully transported up the narrow, windy roads in the Berkeley Hills to be returned to the museum. KTV's Ali Rasmus here now to show us all the work that was involved, Ali. Well, Gossia, yeah, that popular whale, whale sculpture actually has a name. I grew up going to the Lawrence Hall of Science as a kid, and even I didn't know this till today. Fina the whale was sculpted by an artist uh, named Larry Foster back in 1975 with a grant from the World Wildlife Fund. And it's been a fixture outside the front entrance of the Lawrence Hall of Science in the Berkeley Hills ever since. But Fina was in need of some repairs. Take a look at this time lapse video that shows the weeks of work involved in refurbishing this locally beloved sculpture. Fina, the Lawrence Hall of Science whale, is made of fiberglass. It is 50 feet long. It was designed to be a life-size version of a fin whale. It took about a month for the sculpture to be sanded down and repainted at a boat yard in Point Richmond. As it turns out, Fina is not that dissimilar from a boat. You know, boats are made out of fiberglass, which is the same uh, kind of material that Fina is made out of. When we first brought her here five years ago, I remember the folks who work here saying that she's basically an upside down boat. Now, just about 90 minutes ago, the 3,000 pound sculpture was loaded onto a flatbed truck and began the journey back to the Lawrence Hall of Science after a month of repairs. It was carefully hoisted off that truck, and as of just about 20 minutes ago, it was secured in its usual spot in front of the museum. Now, for more than four decades, generations of kids have climbed on, jumped off of, played on this life-size whale sculpture. Kids from all over the area come uh, for field trips or they come with their families. And, you know, FINA is the first thing they see when they come on to the plaza. You know, we do like to say that science learning starts before you even enter the building, and uh, FINA is a big part of that. After being shut down for more than a year because of COVID restrictions, the Lawrence Hall of Science has begun its reopening process. They have outdoor exhibits open already this summer, and they're planning to reopen all their exhibits indoors in October. Reporting live, Ali Rasmus, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Well, Ali, like you, I was there as a child, and I've had the pleasure of bringing my own little ones to the whale to climb on it, so we'll have to make a trip once again. Good to see. Thank you, Ali. Absolutely.